up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to Phoenix Rising. This game has been, we've been hearing about this game for so long, and it's finally here in a beta version, and we are going to be playing it. It's going to be our newest project on the channel in our main time slot. We'll talk about that in a little bit. I'm so excited to jump in. I'm probably going to skip over a whole bunch of stuff. But before we jump in, if this is your first video checking out, the first series that you're checking out on the channel, there are two things that I think we need to go over. Hi, my name is Domino, spelled with a zero in case you didn't know, and the first of those two things is that we are a PG PokeTuber channel. But we're not a cringy PG PokeTuber channel, no, no, no. Instead, we still have fun, we still make jokes, we still laugh a lot. This game is very loud. And I, I'm going to have to go back and listen to this, but it does get quieter. I, che I checked it out. But anyway, um, yeah, we are a PG um, PokeTuber channel. All that means is that we just choose our words differently. And I think that's okay. I think it's okay to have fun without using bad language. So that's what we do here. Um, and the second thing is that if you're looking for someone who likes to go through games quickly and just hit all of the highlights and all of the story spots this probably won't be the channel for you no instead we're going to explore everything that the games have to offer that's how we've always been with all of our games we're going to do everything that the games has to offer unless we're like replaying pokemon red i mean obviously then we're just going to hit all of the stuff as we go through it not that we're playing Pokemon Red anytime soon, but like in this game, we're doing everything. And if that winds up taking us extra episodes, that's okay. I think it's okay with having filler episodes. So that's what you have to look forward to. Now, if you do wind up enjoying, you should already know what to do. But because YouTube is changing stuff, let me tell you what you should do. Number one is you should hit the subscribe button. But since that's not enough, you should also hit the little bell icon thing. I don't know. I don't like saying this, but YouTube kind of forces it. Um, but if you also hit the thumbs up down below, just letting us know that you're enjoying it. I'm ready to get to it. So can we just get to it? Let's check out our options. Tech speed, we're going instant. I'm going to start with fast. Battle scene on, definitely. Temperature units in Fahrenheit because I'm in America. <sighs> Not that one is right or wrong. Uh, let's hit play. I'm, I'm, I'm just ready. I'm just ready. Nuzlocke mode. Nah, not for our first playthrough. Not for our first playthrough. The game you're about to play is a fan-made Pokemon creation. It is created by a group of part-time volunteer non-professional game developers and honors the game is free and always will be. We accept no money. We just love Pokemon and creating unique experiences. And that's why it took so long, which is great. I'm excited, but I'm not going into it with too many expectations. Good morning! I have some last minute documents I need you to complete for Trinity University. I'm still used as a mouthpiece for the school since I completed my studies there all those years ago. First, I need you to create an avatar. Just create one that best expresses your personal style. Now, for the demo, I think we only get to choose between these two. Um, for the full game, I think we'll get to customize our character. I might go with the female. Nah. Are you sure? Yes. All right. I'm changing that text speed immediately. Next, I need you to input your name here. How about Alto? Uh, but how come I can't use like my? Wait. All right. Anyway. Okay. Uh, as I said before. The directions on this are weird. Domino with the zero. Thank you for indulging me, Domino. I bet you're looking forward to your adventure. Be sure to stop by my lab before you skip town. I have something you'll want to see. Ciao! Is that like my laptop or what? Presenting... Oh! I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I don't know if that's going to pause the game. Good, I'm glad it didn't. Oh my gosh! This game has been so long in the making. Look at this! Oh, you know what? And after this demo, we're going to have to wait again. Bro, this is nice. This is nice. 
Like, this is nice. Oh, I'm so excited. Now, I know a lot of people are playing this game. I know every Poketuber is probably playing this. If you chose to click on our video and you're choosing to go on this adventure with us, thank you so much. I appreciate you so, 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 so much. Was that a shiny Nidoran? I noticed it was a different color, but... Hawthorne Woods. I love that title! Have I ever told you why I live in Hawthorne Woods, Domino? Is this like an older guy? Most assume I think that I longed a natural setting to be one with nature. Certainly the Pokemon are kind and the flora is magnificent, yes? I even admit my cooking has greatly improved since I began my heritage. What was that word? Hermitage, maybe? But I would not live away from society for a pretty view. That would be silly. No, I live here because I can find pure. Out here, I'm able to reflect on my life to think more clearly than I ever have. When I was your age, finding a thinking place was very simple, a quiet place. That's not so true anymore, yes? Now the world is very, very complicated. This is good to keep in mind. Find a quiet spot to call your own. Think there. Allow yourself the time to think on your life, your circumstances. For well, you see, Domino, it is when one thinks that one realizes. Not all is right with the world. Hold on, I've got to make a change real fast. See, the music changes so much. <sighs> oh, what a windbag I am. Come, let us have your tea before you depart. I'm going to guess these guys that made the game were stationed like in, uh, in England, Great Britain, something like that. Okay, we've got a quest. Whoa, press the X key to open your menu. You can access your journal containing your quest there. What the heck is going on? I have $8,000. Difficulty is set to normal. Sounds good to me. Journal, it's so loud. Oh my gosh, that's even loud. All right, hold on. I'm going to... I'm going to adjust this in just a second. Actually, I'm going to adjust it first thing. Find our settings. Options. Instant, please. Master volume. We'll definitely get the audio all sorted out for next time. I just didn't want to jump too far in the game because I wanted my initial reactions. Difficulty. Eh, we'll stick with normal for now. It's just a demo. Okay, so what do we got? We got a journal. Side missions? Pokey hunt? Okay, they're gonna have to work a little faster on this game because I'm, I'm gonna wanna play this. I'm gonna wanna play this. Let's take a look at the town map. What? Look at how big this area is. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm going to I'm going to like this. This is amazing. There's so much. Let's look at our ID. Look at how good it looks. Oh, you know what? I was going to look at one more thing. Okay, I can't change the window size just yet. So, I hope it's not too blurry. I hope it looks okay. Okay, I can't move very fast just yet. All right, what is what is clicking on stuff? I love the the sun rays at the top. Okay, I really really can't move that fast just yet. Press the Z key to use your running shoes. You can toggle them permanently on and off using the shift key. Thank you. There we go. Oh, we always run in here. <clears throat> hey there. Did you know you can hop over these ledges to access lower areas? Only problem is I haven't figured out how to climb back up again. Trainer tips. You can arrange your items by holding down the confirm button while using directional keys. Okay. Since he doesn't know how to get back up, I'm not going to go that way. Come, come. I have a lovely tin of biscuits for you to try. My, my uh, English accent needs work. I feel like I should explore. Oh, I feel like I should explore. You can find some pretty sweet stuff lying on the ground sometimes. Potions, blah, 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 blah. 
Oh, I know what everything does. Trust me. I've been playing Pokemon since before you was programmed. Since long before you was programmed. I don't even know about berries. Bro. I love this game window. Like, I love how there's like a... There's like a focus point on me. And then like the outside, it's like a... It's like a, a sh like a, a shadow inwards. All right, let's... If I jump, jump. Okay. Now, I don't know if they meant like hidden items are found on the ground all the time. I don't... I don't know. What's this way? Oh! Domino, I thought you were having tea. Come inside if you would. Fine. I guess I'm going inside. Also, auto toggling run. Thank you, Phoenix Rising. Unlike some other games we're playing right now. A lesson in destiny. Objective complete. Meet the soothsayer for tea. Domino, I'm so glad you decided to come over one last time. It warms an old man's heart, truly. Then on such a moment to stay, off to Trinita University, and you're receiving your first Pokemon, yes? I'll turn on the kettle, Domino. Are you nervous about the events to come? You're in capable hands. I'm sure the good doctor will give you the best of the lot. You know, Professor Lotus met with me before her own journey to your school. Trinita University surely snaps up the best talents of the Hawthorne region. The, the both of you, the prides of our little nocturne town. Although it is a different situation with, with what with your father and all. What with your father and all? What is it? What are you looking for, old man? I'm sure you're excited to see him after so many years apart. And your mother is doing well? Sad to see you go? I don't know. Do I have a home? Do I have a mother? How perplexing. You lost something. What'd you lose? She's always been the hardy. Your mother never fazed by a thing. But to have her only child about to depart from her home must be trying. When my... Why, when my own children took their leave from me, I... I... I have some bad news, Domino. I think perhaps there is a possibility I am out of tea. Oh, I'm embarrassed. I'm going dotty. Didn't even check my own stores. You know what? I imagine your mother has tea. Your father was a tea fanatic. Although I feel terrible asking this, could you run home and check with her? Without fail, a good cup of tea, a good cup of tea will calm your anxieties before this journey. You will run there, yes? You will? Wonderful. I'll be here waiting for your return. Like tea from mom. New objective, visit the lab. Where, where the lab at? Oh, it said very cool. I like the, uh, I like the sound that the text makes when it, uh, when it clicks through. Okay, so I'm gonna assume now I'm supposed to come up this way. <gasps> I'm sorry! I didn't, I didn't mean to scare anybody away. I was just, you know, running. Nocturne Town, Professor Lotus's house. Hello, Domino. So nice to see you. I remember when you were yay high. Most everyone in Nocturne Town is getting of age. Not much is different here from when I was a young girl. Wait. Why would you point out my my height? Have I been gone? Hey there, Domino. Are you looking for Professor Lotus? I haven't seen her since this morning. Have you checked her lab? If not there, she is probably called away. Why don't you ask Tim where she is? The, sooth the soothsayer might know too. Look at that TV. Hold on. We're going to check that TV out in just a minute. What's this? Chock full of research notes and work emails. Wonder if any games are installed. We can play that new Phoenix Rising we've been waiting for for years. TV is faintly warm. Must have been on recently. Seems legit. Seems legit. All right, what's across this way? Also, you know how they were all like, this is for Windows PC only? I haven't owned a Windows PC in 10 years, literally. It works perfectly not on Windows PC. 
It works perfectly on Mac. You just gotta know what to do. I used to live in Salt Tempo City, which is a really exciting place to live. After a while, though, I couldn't take the urban life anymore, so I came here. There are a lot of old people here. It's quiet, really quiet. I'm really going to have to take a listen back to this music and see and see what we think. Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon. <clears throat> Who house is this? Who house this though? My husband often takes walks around town. I suppose it could be relaxing, but nothing has ever changed here. Yeah, this this seems uh we are so lucky to have a Pokemon professor like Professor Lotus. In some ways, she has really put Nocturne Town on the map. Her intellect is incredible. She might be the smartest person in the region. You know, I'm going to go on a limb and say she might be the smartest, but I'm probably the strongest. I'm just guessing. I'm just guessing. I bet this is my house. What you think? What you think? What you think? This is mom. Oh, Domino, you're home early. Uh, have you finished already? Normally, the soothsayer can talk me into the ground, the sweet old man. He doesn't have tea. He didn't check before he invited you over. For tea? Well, regardless, he needs tea bags. But I'm not sure we have any ourselves. He really needs to be more responsible living all alone out there. We both know it's not the first time that something has happened like this. Perhaps he could grow his own tea surrounded by all that forest. Not that I don't sympathize with his choice. It's, a be it's beautiful in those woods. Well, look at that tea bags. Not much, but it should be fine for your purposes. You know, I had this crazy thought that your father took all this tea with him. Maybe not so crazy if you remember he did cart away that broken radio. You think he still has it? Neither of us have ever seen his place there. So what's dad up to? I'm sure you'll see the evidence of his tea addiction at the bachelor pad. And you'll have to tell me if he dusts. He, always, he was always terrible about that. Here, let me put these in your bag for you. You'll lose them otherwise. There you are, in the key items pouch, blah blah blah. Now, don't spend too much time on tea business, you cannot be late. Professor Lotus is always so busy, and she's doing you and your father a favor. If you dally, you'll end up with one, with one of your... With one of my hand-me-down Pokemon as your first. In fact, if you're being considered, you stop at a lab and check in. Okay, I really like that there's quests and that it shows up. I would like to be able to move while that's going on. If that could independently work, that'd be really cool. I can't believe they're going to university already. I hope I get a good dorm roommate. <clears throat> when I get to Trinita University, I'm going to join the Battler Guild for sure. Is this a branching path that we'll be able to do? Old lady. Old man this time. Our Hawthorne region has many fascinating myths and stories. Professor Lotus, our native daughter, is the preeminent mythologist. She is often asked to discuss her work on television specials and whatnot. I know the myths, of course. I watch the specials to be see Professor Lotus. I read ahead often when I'm reading stuff like this. I always read ahead. And sometimes when I see a word and I go past it and I'm like, wait, what was that word? Oh, Domino, you're leaving for Trinity University today. You'll travel, travel through Tranquilo Town to get there. Nice, simple place. Not too different from us, really. It's just a quick walk through Route 1. It sounds like there's a, a, a bottom... That sound sounds a little weird. Just a little weird. Oh, there! You see this map? It's used for something called fast travel. I'm not sure how it works, but if you interact with it and choose where you want to go, you'll be taken there in an instant. You can only fast travel to area, areas you've been. Me, I prefer to walk. Okay, bye. Enjoy your walk. I guess, I don't, I don't know. This map is so cool. What's this? What's the little, at the bottom, Right, hello, at the bottom right of it, what is that? Alright, this is said lab, I guess we're stopping here.
Domino. Uh, hey. What voice do I want to give her? What voice do I want to give her? Also, I, if I feel like if I turn up the music, it's going to get too loud yet again. Am I just going to forever adjust the music in this in this series? You're here early. Professor Lotus said you would be here way later than this. Oh, this is her assistant? Uh, you remember me, right? I'm Tim. We've met, like, twice. No, it's no big deal. Uh, welcome. You're here for your first Pokemon, right? That's so exciting. We've been getting them ready forever. Should we wait for Professor Lotus? She said she wanted to be here for this, but I haven't heard from her since. Some kind of errand took her out to Tranquil Town earlier today. Fieldwork has never been my scene, so Lotus left me here to babysit. It's so funny that Lotus does that stuff all the time. She's a hero, sort of. But we actually know her in person, you know? We get to see her, the real her. Yeah, um, I'm stalling. Really, I don't know when she's getting back. You're not that early, maybe she's the late one. As if. I bet you're dying to see them, huh? The Pokemon, they're super cute. Ooh, what Pokemon can I get choose? Well, maybe I can let you look at them. Before she gets here, a sneak peek. That would be okay, right? I'm not using... I'm not... Usurping? What the heck does that word mean? Uh, hold on. I'm gonna ask our friend here. What does usurping mean? Shut up. I clicked the button. Usurp means take a position of power or importance illegally by force. Dang. All right. Well, we're gonna do it illegally. Yeah, it'll be fine. Come on, let's go take a look. Oh, I'm so excited. So, this is Petalil, the bulb Pokemon. Cute, right? Really pretty. A grass type. They're a female-only species and they live soil and they love soil that's rich in nutrients. If you eat their leaves, you'll get a little energy boost. Of course, I've never tried one. Okay, moving on. This is Growlithe, the puppy Pokemon. Don't you love that hair, that shaggy na mane? They're a fire type. Growlithe are domesticated Pokemon and they really get attached to you. Apparently they can smell your emotions. Weird, right? Super noses. Okay, last one. You excited? Mmm. This is Staryu, my personal favorite. Aren't they cool? I love water types. They're the star-shaped Pokemon because they're superstars. Plus, they're able to physically regrow their limbs, which is like insane. Oh, I shouldn't have done this. Now you really want one, huh? Oh, I don't know. Look, why don't you just go ahead and pick one? The professor was going to give you one eventually, right? I can tell her later. And I know how exciting it is to go to own your own your first Pokemon. I'll be waiting at the front of the lab, so let me know when you've decided. Good luck. No pressure. All right, before I started, I had an idea of who I wanted to pick. Sometimes you might want to reset the game and reload your save pile. Remember to save your game or you'll lose progress. Well, that's what we're going to do right now. Let me go ahead and save. This is so cool! Why can I just walk up to them? Wait, I can just walk behind him? What? That's not fair. Uh, do I want... Who do I want? Who do I want? Who do I want? Uh, okay. Let's, let, let, let me, let me talk through it. Let me talk through it. Oh, that's a thumbnail right there. Anyway, <laughs> um, I think everyone's going to choose Growlithe. I've never been a huge fan of Arcanine. He's cool and all, but he's supposed to be a legendary. He's lacking. And I've really never been a fan of Petalil Lilligan. That's just from 5th gen, Ixnay. Ixnay. We're going to pick Staryu. 
Now, should I? Nah, it's a demo. It's a demo. Yes! Ooh! Would I like to give a nickname? Okay. Now, I could nickname this Patrick for obvious reasons, right? Actually, after saying it out loud, that kind of makes, like, perfect sense. Um... I kind of want to go with a different name. I'm terrible at nicknames. I'm so bad at nicknames. I am so, so, so bad at nicknames. Um, but we're going to go with... I think I've decided. We're gonna go with Emily. We're gonna go with Emily the Star You. Now why? Now why? Okay, Star Me. You know how it, it spins 360? Well, it's kind of like a, a spinning top, right? It's kind of like a Beyblade. When I think about Beyblade and I think about girls, I think about Emily. I don't need to explain anymore because if you know Emily, you'll uh, you'll get it. You'll understand. Toggle Pokemon following. Oh, oh! If you ever wish to put your Pokemon back as Pokeball or take it out again, press Control. No, I'm leaving it. It's staying right there. Oh, this is so beautiful. Look, I'm getting a little teary-eyed. You're gonna love Trinity University, my alma mater, especially now that you have a lifelong friend to help you through it. And now we wait for Professor Lotus to get back from her trip. She still has some things to give you, advice or gadgets or something. I don't think I can let you go exactly without having seen her first. Life like a lotus. What does that mean? Oh, this is a good lesson. So, Tranquil Town is east of here. You would take Route 1 to get there. It connects Tranquilo to Nocturne. Route 1 is short and Tranquilo Town is really tiny, smaller than Nocturne. So, Professor Lotus won't be long, we just have to wait. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up episode one right here. Now, couple of last minute, you better focus, couple of last minute things. Um, this series will be Monday through Friday, 6 p.m. Central Time in our main time slot. That's when our main series typically come out. Um, obviously this video is going to be different than that because this is launch day. So I wanna get this up sooner than that. Now. If this video gets enough love, which I don't know what that entails, uh, but I'll go ahead and release another episode tomorrow because we didn't really get to do anything in this. Um, I can release another episode tomorrow. Uh, if not, that's perfectly okay. Episode number two. Episode number two will happen <clears throat> on Monday when I'm hopefully not sick anymore. Goodness gracious. But anyway, if you enjoyed, if you're excited for Phoenix Rising, I'm gonna go, actually I'm gonna wrap up this first episode over here okay if you enjoyed episode number one hit the thumbs up down below if you're excited for phoenix rising to be here hit the thumbs up down below if you're new hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit the little bell icon thingy -ma bobber just because youtube doesn't like to show videos and we'll see you whenever the next episode comes out until then spread some positivity be the light and have a blessed day